welcome back to another Create a Sim video in The Sims 4. It's been a little while since I did a Create a Sim video, and I've always wanted to try the magic pack that came out forever ago, but I never actually played it since I wanted to create Nozomi first. Now, I'll be honest, I've been CC searching for quite a long time, and I barely found anything that was decent or close to the outfits in Sif or Sif AS. So I mainly just put her in random outfits that I felt that would suit her. But at the same time, I tried to make it close to the outfits I was trying to recreate from Sif or Sif AS. I will say, some of the outfits are spot on and I really like it, but there are some outfits that didn't turn out so well. It's probably because I got so stressed out looking for custom content so that I just ended up giving up and deciding to use whatever I have in my game, custom content or not. I am disappointed by that, but it's like, what can you do really? I mean, I guess I could attempt to create custom content myself, but I don't know how to do that, and I think I would be terrible at it anyway. But yeah, this took quite a long time. I'm glad Nozomi's all done. I'm disappointed how she turned out for some of the outfits, but like I said, it's whatever you find or whatever the game has you have to work with. I was also CC searching for Maki and Yo, and those two were pretty hard, just as much as Nozomi, so I'm kinda not looking forward to making Maki or Yo anytime soon. I do plan on using Maki for the island living pack. I don't know what I'm gonna use Yo for, but I'll figure it out when the time comes, I guess. Now, for Nozomi's aspiration and traits, that was pretty hard as well, because, you know, with Nozomi being a fortune teller, I wanted to give her the wellness aspiration, but, like I said, since I'm using her for the magic pack, I decided to give her the spellcaster aspiration, and then the traits, I gave her creative, because she's the one who came up with the group name for Muse, and then, of course, I put her as a music lover because, well, she's in Muse and, of course, they sing and dance. And I'm not looking at the footage right now, but I forgot her third aspiration, but whatever one I put, I felt like that would suit her. Because the wiki page, it gave me taking naps and fortune telling as her hobbies. And, of course, the game doesn't really have that. Well. The game has lazy, but I feel like Hanukkah would be more on the lazy side compared to Nozomi. No offense to Hanukkah. We're all lazy, I understand. But anyways, yeah, that's about it. I know it's not much. I'm just bummed out that Nozomi gave me a lot of stress. I'm just glad she's done though, and I'm happy with some of the outfits I gave her. Others, not so much. But yeah, anyways, I'm just gonna leave now because I actually don't know how long this recording's gonna be since I'm gonna speed the footage up a bit. But yeah, anyways, thanks for listening and enjoy this creative sim of Nozomi.